If you guys are looking to buy some cheap and reliable MT, head on over to AOLA.com and use code YBC at checkout for a discount. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's YBC and I am back. Bring another video and in this video, I am going to be playing in my 12th NO championship game for Galaxy Open World Chamberlain in NBA 2K20, my team. Before we hop into it and everything, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys go ahead and consider hitting that subscribe button. Right now, we are on this road and grinding 80,000 subscribers, so I'm to achieve that 80k goal today by hitting that subscribe button. And also, if you guys could do me a real quick favor and drop a like on this video, that would be greatly appreciated. Let's see if we can hit 550 likes on this video. Now, I do want to say that when it comes to this video right here, guys, I did record the intro right here that I'm recording now and the outro completely separate from the gameplay. That is because, guys, when I played this game right here, guys, I sweated, I sweated and stayed up pretty much all night. And honestly, I was just simply too tired to record an intro and outro for the video. With that being said, you guys will see a little bit of change of scenery in the gameplay and the intro and outro. You guys see right now, I have a Wisconsin straight on. I had a completely different shirt during the gameplay. The closet is rearranged a little bit differently. My hair is different from when I record the game. But with that being said, it does feel a little bit weird to record this intro right here after I already played the game. But getting back on track right here, take a look at this screenshot right here. I was 11 and 0, so you guys can see that proof that I was 11 and 0. So now the last thing that I want to talk about in this video right here is the lineup that I did use for the game. So diving straight into it right here, as you guys can see, take a look at the screen. Here was a 10-man roster that I did use for the game. We do have right here Gallows Gilbert Magic Johnson at the point guard position. At the shooting guard, we have Gallows Gilbert Trace McGrady, who I think is a top five card in NBA 2K20 my team. At the starting small forward position right here, guys, we have Diamond Jonathan Isaac. And in my opinion, guys, this card right here is the cheesiest card in NBA 2K20 my team because he's like Giannis with a better release and simply can't shoot. He's basically just like a shooting version of Giannis and it's as simple as that. At the power four position right here, I do have Gallows Global James Worthy. He was a player of the month card for last month in March. And this card right here, guys, is a glitch. And moving on right here to the center position, I do have even a bigger glitch than James Worthy. A speed boosting seven foot Gallows Global Carlos and E Towns. At the point guard position off the bench, I do have this Gallows Global Derek Rose card right here, guys. He is an all around buck and he can do everything on the floor. At the shooting guard, I do have this Oval Bradley Bill card, who in my opinion has the best release in NBA 2K20, my team. He just simply does not miss any shots wide open. At the small four right here, guys, I have this Dr. J card. And honestly, I don't think that Dr. J is going to be getting much minutes, mainly because I mainly have this card right here to scare people and to scare the guy who I play, play up against next. Because once he sees Opal Worthy and Opal Dr. J, he's probably going to be pissing his pants a little bit because of how sweaty I, I, what I am and how sweaty it took for me to get these two cards right here. These two cards are like the sweatiest two cards in the game because you have to go 12 and 0 to get Worthy. You have to go like 60 and 0 to get Julius Irving. At the power four position right here, as you guys can see, I have this Diamond Marquis Chris. I mainly have this Diamond Marquis Chris card right here, mainly because I'm a Warriors fan and I love using my Warriors players. I do have better players in my collection, honestly, than this Chris card, but he's one of my favorite cards and he honestly belongs on this team. And I'm going to be playing with them in this video in this 12 0 championship game. He is most definitely going to be getting some playing time. As moving on right here to the center position and the last card on this squad who I'm, who I'm going to be using, I'm not going to be using these three bronze players right here. Last time who I'm going to be using is this Galaxy Open Dave Robinson card. I chose D Rob over Dwight for his lineup right here, mainly for shooting purposes. I feel like D Rob is a much better shooter than Dwight Howard, the Opal version of Dwight Howard. So now that I have went over everything that I needed to go over right here in this intro, it is now time you guys find out if I got this W in this 12 game for Wilt all right here we go guys we have found ourselves a game for this 12th game and he has himself a squad of some pretty cheesy and sweaty cards that Kevin Porter Jr. is a cheesy card Manu Bowl is a very cheesy card Bong at the point guard is pretty cheesy. James Worthy, guys, is a very, very sweaty card. Now, I do want to take a look at his bench real quick. If he does press the pause menu, he did press pause menu. And, oh my gosh, he has Galaxy Global Joyce Irvin off the bench and Cam Reddish and Giannis. My goodness, his team is just filled with the sweatiest and the most cheesy cards in a game like this this guy has himself a really good team and i know he's pretty good guys because he does have those unlimited reward cards this game right here is definitely not going to be an easy one to win but let's go on and take care of business and get this w here to pick and pop between magic and cat okay he's playing lows hit cat on a pop catch and shoot for cat from deep very okay i'll take that i will take that i said very late in which it was and i thought it was gonna be off let's go we strike first we got very lucky on the first play good d good right defense cat let's go board by worthy let's go worthy put your ball off the court right here to cat run the floor team back fade to the corner team back fade to the corner over for the mid range and that shot right there is cash we're getting very lucky making our first two shots guys very late and a full white bar right there 
Okay, my opponent is getting very unlucky right here, guys, early on. Now I'm getting super lucky. As I want a fast break to Isaac in a corner wide open for three. Bang! The luck is definitely on our side early on in this game as we're up eight to zero. Good D. Oh, give me that. Thank you. I read that steal like a book. Or that pass like a book to Isaac in a corner. Four to mid-range open. That's green. Nice shot, Jonathan Isaac. Way to knock down your open shots. I honestly feel like that Diamond Jonathan Isaac car right there, guys, does have good defense, Cavs. We get that block. Now we're on a fast break. It's James Worthy. I'm stopping, and I'm popping. 4-3. Splash. Nice shot, James Worthy. But as I was trying to say a little bit, I'm not really going to be commentating over players that much. But as I was trying to say about that, that's actually a really good shot that he just made right there. But about Jonathan Isaac's shot, as I was trying to say, I feel like he has the best shot in the corner. It is super, super easy to green. As we have him in the post right here in the low post area. Going with this one in the paint. And I just got snatch blocked by Brian Skyler Brady. Oh my goodness, this game sucks. Let's go to work right here with Tracy McGrady. Tracy McGrady open from deep. He's off balling. I'm splashing a three-pointer right there with my boy Tracy McGrady. I don't know why he's off balling on me, guys. I know how to beat that off ball defense. So it looks like right here, guys, Skyler Brady's forced me middle, and I'm gonna take it. Nice jab step by T Mac. I'm attacking the paint, hop stepping, going all the way with a nice ferocious two and a dunk in the paint. Great finish inside T Mac. Okay, this man Ken Porter with Jr. right now, guys, cooking me up. And honestly, that Ken Porter Jr. card right there is the only reason why my opponent is somewhat in this game. Because that Ken Porter Jr. card right there, guys, has, I believe, like 12 or 15 points. We got Tracy McGrady, though, so I'm not worried. Cat in the corner. Nice move by Cat, attacking the paint, going all the way with a nice double pump reverse dunk. This right here is going to be likely the last possession of the first quarter. So let's end it off right, right here with Tracy McGrady to Cat wide open in the paint. Oh, we, we could fit that pass down there. Cat with one second on his clock left. And that post hook is good over Skylar Brady. Nice finish. As my point has 0.5 seconds left right here. And I doubt we'll get up a shot. We actually get the inbound steal. Because we're going to be up by five points heading into the second quarter. Very solid very solid first quarter from the squad offensively. Defensively, I have to tighten up a little bit in the second quarter and the rest of the game. Good defense from Cat. Let's go. That's a great way to start off the second quarter defensively on a fast break. He's stepping up. I got Cat running. Same with T Mac. Way to run the floor, my guys. My guys right there ran that fast break like beauty. Honestly, they could not have ran that one right there any better. Good defense, Magic. Oh my gosh. So I guess this man, Victor Oladipo, Diamond Oladipo, can just punch on Magic like that. On to the next play right here. And he's picking me right there. Oh my gosh. This guy right here is just it's good. He's good. And as I can say, can't say he's cheesing me. This guy right here is just simply good. I'm down by one. Beautiful screen by Worthy. To Isaac in the corner. Wide open. 4-3 green. Beam. As I said earlier, he has the best corner release in the game. He does not miss out the corner. I nearly get that inbound steal. Way to hustle for that ball, T-Mac. Good defense, Cat. Let's go. Cat up to Beal. Up to Isaac. As Isaac going all the way with the nice two-handed dunk. My boy, John and Isaac right here came to play in this game. Oh, steal. Give me that. Oh, jump in his face. Jump in his face. Jump. You got to jump. You got to jump. That's fine. I'll, I'll leave. I'll leave Bull with the dunk. That's fine. As long as we did not get over three right there, guys, because he had himself a pretty open three. We did check Bradley Bill into the game right here, guys. Gonna go to work with him a little bit. Nice screen up top by Cat. I'm com come off of it. Cat rolling all the way. We got lucky. He did not press a button right there. And I'll take a dunk. I did just check right here, as you can see, some of the players off my bench, including Marquise, Chris, and Bradley Beal. High ping pop action right here between Beal and, I mean, Rose and Chris. Chris wide open on the wing. 4-3 green. Beam for my boy Marquise, Chris. Way to come in and knock down your shot. High ping and pop action right here between Beal and Worthy. Good screen and three from Beal. Bang, bang. Green light from my boy Beal. Way to knock down your open shot. That's exactly what my team is doing right now, guys. They're knocking down the greening the majority of their shots. Good D, give me that. I read that like a book. Thank you very much. Isaac with the steal on the break to Beal. Way to run the floor. Bradley Beal with a nice two-handed dunk inside. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, he's leaving Rose. Wide open for three. Green beam from my boy Derrick Rose. With that three-pointer right there, guys, we have ourselves our largest lead in the game right here at nine points. Let's try and expand it right here and play some defense. Good defense, Isaac. Way to fight. Way to fight through the screen, Isaac. Someone help. Someone help. Someone help. Good rotation. Great rotation. Great. And I mean great rotation. Good rotation. Great. Stay on this. Stay on this. Double team this. Send a double team. Send a double team. Good double. Good double. Good double. That's what I'm talking about, Johnson Isaac. Let's go. We're up by nine points. And he's pausing the game. Let's go. I kind of thought it was going to quit for a second right there. We have a jump ball right here, and we need this tip most definitely. It's Isaac versus Cam Reddish. This should be Isaac's ball right here. No doubt about it. I'm going to jump as soon as it tips in the air. We got it. Oh, no. Manu Bull got it. Wow. That's just because of his length. Come on, 2K. I'm here in the paint. I'm here on the paint on Bull. He's just simply too tall. Good defense, Chris. Great D. We can't get that board, though. But we're still playing great defense. Good block by Chris. With that block right there, guys, we're going to be... Oh, we made a full-court shot, yo. With that shot right there, we're actually going to be up by 10 points heading into the second half. What a fair way to end off this first half. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know who did that. I think it was Isaac who did that. But as I said earlier, that man Isaac came to play.
Good defense on Skylar Brady. Let's go. Big boy by Chris. Up to Worthy on a break. To Beal. Keep running, Rose. Keep on running. Derek Rose, we're lobbing up to him. And he, we didn't get the lob. It's all good. Got Chris wide open with that cash money jumper. And he's knocking down that three-pointer. Nice shot, Chris. Step up on the screen. Step up on the screen. Look at him zigzagging. He's zigzagging. He's zigzagging. He don't know what to do. He does not know what to do. Jump in there. Jump in his face. Great defense. But that's still going to go in. I know 2K at this point. This game is so bad. On to the next play, though. Right here. Gonna attack it. Hit Chris in the paint. Nice pass. And two and a dunk for my boy, Marquise Chris. This man just keeps on trying to zigzag. And this man, Oladipo, does not have unpluckable. I really wish he would try to zigzag with Victor Oladipo. That's actually a good shot. But it's off. Boy by Marquise Chris, and he has a takeover badge. And this man right here, guys, is staying into the game. Even my starters are coming in right now, guys. This man, Marquise Chris, has to stay in the game. This man is hooping right now with that glass clean takeover badge. Right here, guys, I'm going to try to run a nice pick and pop between Magic and Chris and try to look for him on a pop. Never mind, we got the paint wide open. Hot 7 going all the way with a nice one-handed dunk. And with that dunk right there, guys, we have our largest lead of the game right here at 20 points. Good defense from Worthy of a T-Mac. Down the court, T-Mac stopping and popping and greening that three-pointer. Let's go, T-Mac. Knowing what that goes in, what is this man doing as we do right here? Force ourselves to rage quit in this game. And it's right here, guys. Because we got the rage quit, we are likely going to be getting Galaxy Open World Chamberlain now as we did just finally win our 12th game. And once we got back into the main menu after we won that game, as you can see right here, I do have a screenshot on my account of us getting that Galaxy Open World Chamberlain card. As I mentioned earlier, guys, I'm recording the intro and outro a little bit differently and at separate times due to me just simply being too tired to continue with the intro and outro from when I was wearing the blue shirt. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie guys, I got lucky in two ways. The first way I got lucky was in a gameplay, you know, I was just simply getting a lot luckier than my opponent was. I was making a lot of full whites and I even made a couple reds during that gameplay. And the second reason why I got lucky guys is because I got Galaxy of Bull Chamberlain. Galaxy of Bull Chamberlain, I'm sure a lot of you guys know, was glitched for a lot of people in my, in my team community. And it might have, it might have, might have been glitched for you guys as well as some of you guys are watching this video. A lot of people who went 12-0 like the first day didn't get their Bullet Chamberlain card. Even when they hit up 2K support, guys, they still didn't get they, their card for some odd reason. But yeah, we got some of that good 2K look on our side today in this video right here, guys. So we got that Opal Wilt, which was a massive, massive W. Before this video ends off, I want you guys to let me know down below in the comment section real quick how your 12-0 grind is going for you guys this month. Are you guys playing up against a lot of sweats? Are you guys dodging the sweats? Have you got Opal Wilt yet? Just simply let me know if you guys have played any games in the comment section and how that 12-0 run is going for you. So now that right there is pretty much going to conclude and wrap up this video right here. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you guys go on ahead and consider hitting that subscribe button. Also drop a like would be greatly appreciated as well. I do apologize again about being, about having the intro and the outro being recorded separately than a gameplay. I will try my best next time to not do that. And if I'm too tired, I probably won't record next time. But honestly, guys, even when I'm tired, you guys can see during the gameplay, I still have energy. For some odd reason, whenever it comes to the gameplays, I always have a lot of energy to record no matter how tired I am, no matter how much I stay up. But yeah, that's besides the point. That's pretty much how I'm going to do it. And I'll catch all of you guys in the next one. And as usual, as always, thanks for watching. And it's YBC and I'm out. Peace.